Well, we left the hotel about 10 hours ago and we still got 70 miles and we stopped here on the side of the road and I, th I think this is the Snake River Canyon. I'm not sure exactly what this is. I know it's a long way down there to that water. Huh. I wanted to sort of surprise my wife, but I want you to know that God is love. The Bible says that. Yeah. God is love. Until you learn how to love God, until you start receiving the love of God, you don't really know how to love others. Mm. And yes. we've been married mm. now for quite a while, and I just mm. want to tell you on camera, while I got the chance, how much I love you, <laughs> how much I'm thankful for holy matrimony. I love being your helpmate. I love the fact that you've never deceived me in any way. And I love trusting you. I love how faithful you are to me and, and to God. And I just love how much you love Him. And how I get to watch that every day. You're patient and you're kind. I adore you and I'm so thankful to be your husband. I consider it an honor. I do. I do. Well, you know what you're hearing are words of life. And Proverbs says, death and life are in the power of the tongue. Mm -hmm. And they that indulge in it shall eat the fruit of it for good or bad. Yeah. So you want to be speaking words of life to your mate. When we first married, one of the first three things God gave me to say to him in a time of prayer was, honey, I love you and that's forever. Yes. And I'm in agreement with you because of the word, the word of God causes us to be in agreement, perfect yeah. agreement. We both believe it. Mm -hmm. Because we've submitted our wills to the Word. Yeah, to the Lord. And then also to tell you that you are anointed to do everything that God's called you to do. Mm -hmm. And I believe in you. It's important that you yeah. let your mate know that you believe in them, that they're anointed to do what God's called them to do. Thank and also you. I just want you to know you're the most wonderful man <laughs> I've ever known and you're the fulfillment of everything I believed for, for a husband. So I'm very thankful for you. The gift of God, when God gives you a mate, it is a precious gift. Yes. And it should always be valued and considered holy and never taken for granted. So I encourage you husbands and wives to build each other up today and just tell each other again how much you love and appreciate each other because God's the one who gave you to each other. We love you. Have a blessed day. God bless you.